I came to London with $50 and a sleeping bag, which is a bad idea because within about a week I was homeless. Sleeping in bus stations, getting my food out of the bins, it's kept me humble and grateful. I think the second that you start to take yourself too seriously, then the joke's on you. I had this statue made of myself one weekend. Came up quite well, I think. I got given an opportunity to open a tiny studio in the bottom of a muse house. I just took it and ran with it. But we lost it, we lost the business. And we lost it twice because we just thought that kindness was king, but it turns out that kindness in a contract is way better. And now we have this beautiful company that's all over the world. Over the years, we learned that what works is simplicity. We've broken it down into four pillars. If you can sleep well, eat well, move well, and think well, then you'll be well. Zen Garden's stressing me out, so I need a smoothie and a poo. No, no, the poo stays in. You do need to poo every day, and if you're not, there's something wrong. Don't trust experts, question everything. Read the labels and understand, take responsibility for your health, because health is something that you need to be intuitively connected to. You are the expert. How would you describe it? This is the finest thing I've ever had inside me. <laughs> Can I do that again? Bodyism really is a space for people to thrive and flourish, whether it's you know our members or the people that work with us. We're all one big family here at Bodyism. Andy, get out of my way, sorry. Come on through. You know, I've been really lucky. I've never had much to lose, and that's probably the best thing I've ever had. You can go anywhere from there. You know, the value is in your creativity, your ability to create something out of nothing. Thank you for being here with me. You can now leave.